her ankle. Frisco high snap from the shotgun, looking deep left side, and that one overthrown. Intended for the speedy Carlos Henderson, who's one of the quickest, if not the fastest player in the entire conference. It's third and 11. They send Dixon in motion. He's dangerous out of the backfield receiving as well. That one over the middle, caught by Trent Taylor, breaks the tackle, and Taylor is gone just like that. Touchdown, Louisiana Tech. For the touchdown. You see right here, there are no safeties in the middle of the upfield. Rice elected to blitz right there on third down and long, and they got burned. Taylor, he had an opportunity at actual make of the down. Big third nine here. Driscoll to a wide open. Paul Turner pushed out of bounds at the 16 yard line. He had a lot of room there. This is set up, this whole thing is set up by, by Jeff Driscoll and him going downfield, downfield, looking at each of his reads and delivering the football in a position where his wide receivers can get a lot of rack or yak. Out of the pistol. Driscoll play action. Touchdown, Louisiana Tech, Carlos Henderson gets free. That the guy who started this drive ends up finishing it, Carlos Henderson. Jeff Driscoll right there with the with the pump fake delivers the ball in between three right little stacked receiver set. Driscoll, quick throw. Paul Turner evades one tackle and gets down near the 40. This is just another one of the well, again double stacked receivers. Driscoll shotgun. With time, he'll want to run it, and he is brought down. Derek Brown on the stop, the 6'3 junior from Bay City, Texas. We talked with Chris Thurman. He said this young man plays right on that edge, George. Yeah, I, I lost him for just a second amongst those big linemen, and Jeff Driscoll as well. He thought that, that they were playing two-man all the coaches and both schools. Taylor set in motion. Driscoll. Throws it to Paul Turner, and he is wrapped up. Nice tackle made by number 26, Brandon Douglas. Part of this. See, this, this is a nice play, play here. They come back with the screen. Cornerback comes over, avoids a third down here. Huge if Rice could get a stop. Third and nine. Driscoll shotgun looking right side, and that falls incomplete. Going to come off of the left tackle. He just he just gets beat, and Driscoll is hit by by Brown. Two shots downfield. Trent Taylor lined up in the slot. They'll get it to Carlos Henderson. Shifty move, breaks free. Look out, Henderson across the 45. Stopped by Brian Womack. Coach Holt. Coach told us this week that he was going to have some of these plays for for Henderson. He was happy to have him back off for having that, that broken finger right there, making time play, explosive play. Three receivers right, 26-yard gain, quick throw. It's Henderson again. And he'll get into Rice territory at the 49-yard line. Okay. Dixon in the backfield, second and eight out of the shotgun. Driscoll looks right side, complete Paul Turner, and he's wrapped up by Brandon Douglas. But not before he gets to the 40-yard line and a first down. That Jeff Driscoll has. He's a big guy up top, drives the football, perfect throw, hits the receiver right, right in numbers. He uses his hands to catch the football, but also you see the tackle by Douglas. Dixon in motion. Driscoll over the middle, flag on the play, complete to Cameron McKnight. A little bit, at least keep him quiet. Driscoll, they'll dump it off to Dixon. He's dangerous in the open field, and he is dragged down right near the goal line at the one. 
get the monster the football. This is just a little swing pass or an extended handoff. They've been having trouble running the ball. So get that ball in the hands of your playmaker in, in, in space. He runs it down, and that's a decent task to go first half. Taylor in motion. Driscoll rolling left under pressure. Got to get rid of it. And that one's incomplete. Great job by this Rice defense. First and goal inside the, what, on the two-yard line? And was it taunting? Was it eBay again? Wow. Taunt pick up on the play. 2.12 to go. Driscoll over the middle, complete to Taylor. Shifts back left side. Across the 30. Knocked out of bounds. Still going near the 10-yard line. He just kept on motoring. They're going to mark him down near the 11. He had been quiet since the opening drive of the game. Nick Elder saved the touchdown. I was waiting on Jeff Driscoll to take a few shots down downfield right there. Rice is playing zone coverage, and we saw a lot of this when we were watching film, especially, especially in the Western Kentucky game. Rice left a lot of open wide receivers in some of their zone coverage. They can strike quick. They did in their first drive of the game, and now plenty of time left on the clock. Here's Taylor. Shifts back left side. He's inside the five-yard line. It's still a minute 33 to go, and Louisiana Tech still with a timeout. Garrett Furman run the ball effectively. Second and a yard. Nine-yard gain from Dixon. Driscoll chased by Womack. And he's got a wide open. Carlos Henderson had to jump up to get it and able to make the catch. First down in Rice territory. Carlos Henderson is a is a special player here. You see Jeff Jeff Driscoll. This is the thing that you that scouts love about this kid. He's able to, when there's nothing there, to play. Driscoll in trouble and brought down. Sacked. It looks like Alex Lyons is there for the Owls. This is what you would call somewhat of a, of, of a coverage sack. Rice brings two more than, than LaTeX can uh, block, and they're keeping a spy on Driscoll when they're playing man to man coverage. That way, when he does try to take off, that they can catch him in the line of shot. Second and 14, it was Alex Lyons who was so vocal in that comeback win at Florida Atlantic to help spark the team. That pass complete to Trent Taylor near the 31-yard line. Same, same time, you see Trent Taylor making a great play, great physical play right there, but the play's not over. The play's not over. Don't just give yourself up at that point in time. That's where sometimes as at Skip Holtz had said, yeah, Kraft was able to take a little bit of the pounding off of Dixon. This one shot to the end zone, overthrows his target, and that was number 16, Marcus Gaines, the intended receiver. Ryan Pollard on the coverage. They let all the defensive linemen in low like it's a, like a screen play. But then the, the wide receivers are running routes. That's not what in the backfield, third and three. Driscoll goes for the end zone. Intended for Carlos Henderson. Touchdown, Louisiana Tech. Henderson has been huge tonight. Big play by Henderson. Third and third and short. He's guarded by Ryan Pollard. And it's just a simple go route. And he catches it, holds on all the way through the uh, all the way through the ground. This is Henderson has shown that he is the playmaker for Down a sixth year senior having a phenomenal final season. Driscoll takes a shot downfield. He wants Henderson again, and that one incomplete. From the shotgun, Driscoll looks over the middle. It's Henderson again. Henderson with running room across midfield. And he gets blasted by V.J. Banks. And they've already been called for an unsportsman like earlier. Here, the great play of Dixon. Freeze it right here. He picks up right here. He picks up. 
the the blitzer and allows Driscoll some additional time, even though he still got hit, to deliver the ball to the playmaker. And Henderson, he's got to have his head on the swivel a little, a little bit. You won't want to be taking those kind of hits. Six receptions, 115 yards for Henderson. Driscoll pumps, fakes, now fires over the middle, deep downfield, and there's nobody home. Now let's take another look. Plenty of time on this play-action play. You see a little wow. bit of physical physicality, Greg. There, no call on that one. <laughs> Certainly could have gone the other way. Quick throw. That one intended for McKnight. That's Paul's exactly incomplete. That time intended for number and Driscoll. Marcus Gay. His price. Third and ten from the shotgun. Low snap for Driscoll. He handles it, looking deep left side. Intended for Merlin Watts. Falls incomplete. Dixon in the backfield here, third and two. Play action. Driscoll takes a shot deep downfield and he overthrows Marcus Gaines. No flags on the play. Third and nine, they'll go back to the spread here. Four receivers set. Driscoll looking over the middle, caught. Touchdown, Trent Taylor. nation in receptions he's having a career year and now taylor picks up his second touchdown of the night John jeff driscoll just making it easy delivering the ball driving it right in the midst of two rice defenders he's cool in the pocket sees his throw 